हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू आकाश आई एम उमेश वेला योर कैरियर काउंसलिंग एक्सपर्ट हियर एट आकाश होप योर नीट एग्जाम वेंट वेल ओके नाउ इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द कंप्लीट प्रोसेस फॉर द काउंसलिंग फॉर कर्नाटका स्टेट गॉट इट नाउ लेट्स स्टार्ट दिस द कर्नाटका स्टेट काउंसलिंग इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट सम पॉइंट्स विच आर रिलेटेड टू द Karnataka state counseling and the points are the seat matrix the cut off analysis means ki the last year trends and the counseling process okay the official website is given here please have a look on it now the karnataka mbbs seat matrix if we talk about the what how many seats are available for the mbbs in the karnataka state then there are total 72 colleges are available in the karnataka with a total seat capacity of 12000 545 in which 24 are the government medical colleges with a seat capacity of 3800 and the remaining 48 are the private medical colleges with a seat capacity of 8745 the college list is visible on your screen in which the college name the college type and the total intake is also given you can take screenshot for this again the government mbbs college list now you can see the list of the private medical colleges in the karnataka state and the second list for the private colleges in karnataka noted now okay third list okay the fourth list now the moving on the bds seat matrix in the karnataka state total 45 colleges are present in the karnataka state with a seat capacity of 3295 in which 3 are the government dental colleges with the seat capacity of 185 and remaining 42 are the private dental colleges with the seat capacity of 3110 seats okay guys now a list of bds colleges is visible on your screen the second list for the bds and the third list for the bds colleges please take a screenshot of this all the colleges list because these will be helpful in your choice will got it now let's talk about the most crucial point in the counseling which is air absolutely not the crucial point is the choice filling and for choice filling you need your air 2025 which will be shortly provided by the nta but when you get your air 2025 at least you have an idea that in last year means in 2024 year this air was lie in which bracket for the government colleges and for the private colleges am i right okay before this let's discuss a basic fact how many type of colleges or how many type of institutions are available in states then the first one is central government medical college then state government medical college then in the private section the deemed universities and the state private medical colleges okay the state government medical colleges for an example you can take aims you can choose central universities also and the deemed universities these are the private then the counseling for their 100% seats is conducted by mcc medical counseling committee okay and the counseling for the state government medical colleges and the counseling for the state private medical colleges are conducted by the state specific counseling authority got it now here is the refined cut off is given for the category okay for the specific category like 1g 1h 1k 1kh means these are the maximum cut off these are the maximum cut offs on which the government colleges allow the admission in the 2024 got it now here is the the cut off for private medical colleges please take screenshot of the both section because at least this gives you a rough idea 
in which colleges you are eligible to take admission got it guys now if we are going to discuss about the karnataka state mbbs counseling seat distribution the how the seat are distributed in the karnataka state then the government medical colleges 85% seats are reserved for the localites of the karnataka state means these 85% seats are reserved for karnataka localite students then where are the 15% seats then these 15% seats are reserved under mcc aiq means ki all india quota and counseling for these seats are conducted by mcc only done and the private medical colleges the 100% seats are open for all students means the localite of the karnataka as well as outsider student also means if you are a outsider like you are from delhi you are from haryana and you have an valid air which is eligible to take admission in karnataka private medical college under the management quota then you can apply for the karnataka state mbbs counseling also okay now the actual seat distribution is given here as you can see on screen you can take screenshot for this okay noted now the process step 1 complete online registration on the given website the step 2 document verification as per notified scheduled step 3 online choice filling means option entry step 4 allotment of seats and step 5 means ki the final step is the reporting you have to report at your allotted institution or the college with the bond policies with your tuition fee and with your original documents because at the time of reporting the photocopies are not allowed got it guys good now what is the eligibility required to claim 85% seat or the state quota in private medical colleges then the eligibility is for the seats reserved for the localities of karnataka means if you are claiming 85% seats in the gmc then the candidate must have studied from the government recognized educational institutions located in the state of karnataka for a minimum period of 7 academic years commencing from 1st standard to 12th standard and must have appeared or passed either 10th or 12th standard examination from the karnataka state or the candidates should have studied 11th and 12th standard examination within the state of karnataka from an educational institute recognized by the state government and either of the parents should have studied in karnataka for a minimum period of 7 years got it to know more about eligibility criteria you have to wait for the counseling prospectus which will be released by your counseling authority at the time of counseling okay now which documents are required at the time of reporting your 10th and 12th mark sheet means your academic eligibility mark sheet or certificates your neat uz admit card or mark sheet your category certificate your pwd certificate if applicable passport size photograph you need 8 to 10 photograph here government id proof means your aadhar card your voter id card any government id which is provided and other relevant certificate as per the eligibility norms then if we are talk about the scholarship there is a fee reimbursement benefit for the sc st obc and the category 1 candidate in the karnataka state to know more details please visit the given website if we talk about the bond policies then government and private medical colleges the rural services for one year means if you complete your mbbs from the karnataka state then there is rural service means ki mandatory one year rural service is applicable there you can't skip this okay and there is no any discontinuation bond at first we are discussing about a tool then the tool is akash neat rank and college predictor where you can predict your air and the possible colleges you may be eligible for just only with your neat score thank you so much and all the best for your journey